Hey guys, Joshua here, and uh, I'm going to be doing another unboxing. This time it will be of the Champion's Path Pokemon box set. So, let's get started. I'm going to set the camera down. All right. Let's get started on this. There's the box. And there's the back. As you can see, the uh, it comes with a couple pins right here. Uh, here. There are one for uh, the, let's see, um, or the uh, stow on side. And one of the gems involving the fighting type Pokemon gym leader Bea and the ghost type Pokemon gym leader Alistair. No, no relation to Hasbin Hotel, by the way. <laughs> anyway, um, but we will get started on it. So let's crack this one open and see what we get. I'm not quite sure if it's in this set, but I am hoping for the, uh, I guess the, Sh the Charizard that was in this set. Right. Oh, and I'm keeping the box, by the way. You got the uh, comes with five packs, uh, two promo cards, and the pins. As you can see, there's the uh, there they are right there. I'm gonna try to get this. Out. And they're out. Okay, so there's the Gengar right there looking all mischievous as always. Who else but Gengar? <laughs> and I'm a champ. Right. Now here's the uh, pins right here. As you can see, sorry, my hand's in the way. The gym badges. Now, we got that out of the way. I gotta say, though, I like the designs of some of these pins. Right here, the logo design. Especially as a very, uh, Minimalist type feel that a lot of the badges in the Pokemon games have. So let's start on the. Oops. Okay, let's get started on the first pack. Full picks, potion, full heal, 
roly coly. Ooh. I don't know if I'm saying this right, but Turfield Stadium. Hatterene. Darkness Energy. Dark type Pokemon. Not the best. Team Yell Grunt. Machoke. Oh, hey, I got him. Got them a champ right here, so they kind of go together. <laughs> yeah. Quite a coincidence, that one. Rotom Bike. And pause the screen for a little bit. I'm going to share this with everyone. Okay, you got it? Good. Let me do the trash. That one, that goes. Let's see what I got in this, this one. Potion. <gasps> Ooh, this one, huh. Galarian Moon Moon. Always awesome. Nicket. I don't know if I, I honestly don't know if I'm saying the the name right, but here. Nick it. Oh, uh, another coincidence. Uh shop. So I guess at this point I kinda Pretty much have a whole evolution set from Champion's Path at this point. Left to right. From left to right, and uh, there you go. Let's go on to the rest of it. Uh, Ekans, E. Yeah. That one is a uh, foil Malamar. Another Hatterene. Hmm. Uh, fighting Energy. Yes. Suspicious Food Tin. That is kind of sus. Ooh, Pokemon Center Lady. Vict let's see. Victini. And... Pause the screen for this one that comes up. Another one of these little online things I'm going to share with everyone. All right, on to the next one. Oh, by the way, I got another one of these, so. You got it? Okay. Be sure to write it down. Be sure to pause the screen whenever I put those up. Guys, uh, move that out of the way so it's getting in everyone's way. And as for the next one, right here. Oh, what's that? Purloin. Scraggy. Now there are two of them walking down the alley. That's... I like that little type of artwork they did. That's pretty funny. Pokeball Go! Galarian Lanus? Lanu. Lanoon. Sorry. I've been reading it more than hearing it. So, if I get some of the pronunciation some of the Pokemon cards wrong, especially in the newer ones, I apologize. Okay. Yeah. Tenna. A lot of Pokemon with hats. Oh, Best Boy. Piers. Yes. <laughs> that is actually awesome. One of my... One of the best femboys in Pokemon Sword and Shield. And what is this? What is that? It is a... Hmm. Not only anything too exciting, but a Scentiscorch. Uh, fire energy. Another Machoke. Rotom Bike, another one. 
Hyper Potion. And pause the screen because you already know it's coming up. Here you go. Okay. You got it? Good. That's, that's three packs down so far. Now, moving on to the fourth one. Here we go. <laughs> Sizzlepeed, yeah. Weedle, yeah. Galarian Zigazoon, yeah. Ruckluff. Full heal. And what in the... Huh. Foil fire energy. And a foil rare Lycanroc. Might have their first form. I can't say for sure. Not really much from that one. Uh, Psychic Energy, Arbok, Kaboo, a very sus looking food tin, and a uh, Pokemon online thing, Real. Alright, got it? Okay. Last and final pack. Usually it's the last ones that have something good, but we'll see. Good, but yeah. Hmm. Weedle. Another Galarian Zigazoon. Rockluff. Full heal. Scraggy. What the? Another foil energy. Altaria. Don't have their first form, though. Psychic energy. Arbok. Hop. The Rotom phone. And the... Pokemon code. Here you go, for those who want it. Okay, it's all yours. So, overall, that set, uh... I mean, great set, but didn't really get much out of the, uh, booster packs. The highlight, though, is the Pierce card. Mostly just from a lore, fandom lore standpoint. Other than that, uh, pretty good haul so far. Like I said, I'm always looking for more Pokemon cards to add to my collection. And always looking for new stuff to build decks with. I'm also going to be building some other different decks. One deck I'm going to build is like a discard mill deck. Keep in mind, I'm kind of using Magic Gathering terms. Uh, but other than that, this is this is a fun little thing. That the pins are definitely the in there. But so far, the highlights were the Gengar, Machamp, and Pierre's card. Overall, and also I have the uh, Marnie card, the full art, and the, um, regular one. I also made a TikTok video of that one. So, overall, while I didn't get exactly what I was looking for, there were some diamonds in the rough on this one. And some materials used to build it, some, you know, a couple decks. So, uh, this is Joshua with another unboxing, and I will see you guys later. Peace.